Yes, it's been that kind of tournament this DLF IPL and now we've got just one game left. The Kolkata Knight Riders taking on the Chennai Super Kings. It's coming to you live from here in Chennai. 191 to get from 20 hours on a very humid day here in Chennai. Well, the two umpires and all the players are out in the middle now, set for this chase. The Kolkata Knight Riders in pursuit of 191 to win the DLF IPL for 2012. It's a tough task ahead of them. Gentlemen alongside me, Sonny Gavaska, Lakshman Shivarama Krishnan. Boys, enough on the board. I know what you're going to say, Shiva, so we'll go to you second. Well, never. You can never say never. Uh, at the moment, uh, the way the cult of the night had is that batting. Uh, particularly Gautam Gambhir, uh, this uh, score is gettable. I know it's tough, it's the finals, the pressure will be immense, one quiet over, a couple of wickets and the asking rate will go up, but uh, if anybody can do it, uh, uh, it is this man. This, of course, uh, the good news for them is that Yusuf Patan found, found some form two days ago and Manvinder Bisla, who's opened the batting here with uh, Gautam Gambhir and look at those figures, over 2,000 runs for uh, Gautam Gambhir and Manvinder Bisla. He can play some amazing shots. Well, the first ball of the reply, Ben Hilfenhaus. Ball in hand, a little bit of swing. And Bissler up to the mark. Bottom, straight through. Looked like it might have been a slightly slower delivery from Hilfenhaus for mine. He just rolled the fingers across it. And it has gone straight through Gautam Gambier. He was through the shot far too quickly, a huge breakthrough. Yes, he played across the line. The more important thing is that he should have tried to give himself a little more time. That's the slow one. You were absolutely right. Played right across the line and lost in middle and off stump. It's a big wicket. It's the wicket of the inform skipper of the Kolkata Knight Riders. Ben Ilpenau strikes in his first over. Three for one. Cut away. Some work to do for third man. I don't think he'll get it. He won't. So the first boundary up. Very little margin for error. When you're bowling to a class batsman like Jack Cullis, he might not give you the impression that he'll uh, destroy you, but he does it. And it's pulled away. Nicely waited for it. It was another slower ball, just managing to get it over the head. Oh, bravo. And the weight of the boundary. Yes, I think uh, he will play that way. That is the only way that he knows how to bat. Man with the best luck. So he's. That'll be more cool. Continues, and that's a full toss. Nicely played. He's using the pace. There's a little bit of width on offer. Yes, he's going to play that way. I've been saying that. He's a dangerous player. Man with the best luck. Because. Gets that one through the gap. Gave himself a little bit of room towards the leg side and just punched it away. And Charu Khan applauding because uh, he knows that the asking rate has to be maintained. The asking rate has just come down to under 10 now, thanks to those two. Width again, fuller this time, but the same result, four more. He bowled a couple of wides, hence he had to bowl the last delivery. He's got one more to go to compensate for the wide, and that's going very costly indeed. Down the wicket this time and through the covers again. Terrific batting, Manvinder Bissler. An expensive over, 20 off it, four gone, it's 36 for one. Well, he just held that uh, shot in, he didn't uh, try and hit it too hard. It's just a sign of the modern batsman, they back themselves to hit a six without hitting the ball too hard. Well, Bissler's played fantastic, he's used his feet here. There's a touch for me, a, a bit of Rohit Sharma about his style and his confidence. Wonderful straight drive, 76 meters, head down, didn't try and hit it too hard. Well, he's gone for it again, that's an even better shot. He is playing a flyer here on the big day, Manvinder Singh Bisla. Well, Dermot, you were talking about economy rate of R. Ashwin, <laughs> but this is T20 cricket for you. He's gone for 13 of Well, a couple of wides, the extra ball and the runs result. How often have we seen that? Bisla is playing a fly here. 69 for one from seven.
Edge for four. Is it just moving away ever so slightly? Well, that's what you want as a batsman. Now that might go for four too. So we're getting a good cricket match here, watched by a galaxy of former Indian stars. Some of them were out there earlier today receiving their uh, share of uh, the BCCI's profits. Man, I can flight the ball. Yeah, after bounces the beamer all morning. So it was great to hit him out of the ground for six. And I think the ball is still travelling. They never found it. <laughs> well, from then till now, how much has the game changed? Oh, immensely. Yeah. The game has changed immensely. And here's Ashwin. Oh, that's well struck down the ground. And that's gone through. You can see the pressure now beginning to show on the Chennai Super Kings. The one-handed effort will not please the captain there. And again, early in the over. The Knight Rider is getting a boundary. Magnificent. Absolutely magnificent. Great strike for six. It's his highest score in the IPL and what a day Sunny has chosen to do it. Yes, the finals of the uh, DLF IPL 2012. Once again, ter tremendous use of the feet and a proper cricketing shot. Just the lofted cricketing shot. That's all. That's all. And earlier in the day, there was a pulse question about McCallum. Whether it was right of KKR to drop in 65. What a shot. That's a fantastic shot. Jacques Cullis now. A dot first up. And we've been saying it all along. Oh, it's going to be taken. It is taken. <coughs> Simple catch in the end. And is that the breakthrough that gets the, the Kolkata Knight Riders close? But the Chennai Super Kings back in the game. Can they turn this around? Look at those people in yellow. There is that inevitable wicket that we talk about in T20 cricket. Now the challenge for Kolkata Knight Riders is to make sure that this is a minor hiccup. But the required rate still manageable. Plenty of uh, wickets in hand. And I think where he lands is uh, is important. I think he's got his heel behind the line there. But what a hand here for Malvinder Brislav. Standing ovation, outstanding innings of 89. 139 for two. Stages of this final. Beautiful shot. Down the ground for four. And once again, uh, excellent use of the feet, and this is good tactics from Callis. You don't want to leave it too late. You want one big over very quickly now in the next two overs or so. That leaves the pressure. It's another short delivery, and this time it's flat. He's not responding well to pressure, Jakati. He's just not looking to spin the ball. 50 comes up for Jacques Callis. He's connected. It's gone straight to the fielder. Michael Hasi completes the catch. It hasn't worked with Lakshmi Radhan Shukla. Three from six. What a time to pick up a wicket. Mayan Singh Dhoni has got a lot of confidence in Bravo. It's a carbon Kamal catch under pressure. In a well set field. Normally you'll find a man at square leg. But this was deep mid wicket. And Bravo striking once again. A dot ball and then a wicket. Ah, the Chennai Super Kings getting back into it. He's disappointed. Thing hitting toe end of the bat. And look at Hussey. They're all pumped up. It's 152 for three. Is it in the gap? Is it in the gap? Oh, you could not put it more clinically than that. What a shot. We just said Carlos needs to take the lead and he has produced a brilliant shot. Well, is he becoming a little bit predictable here, Dwayne Bravo? Because that's the third slower ball. And now he's going for a big one. Fielders coming underneath. Is it going to go just over? Oh, it's six. He caught it and then was going over. Tried to throw it back in. What a moment. Straight up in the air. Badrinath takes a catch, he's a good fielder. Huge wicket, Yusuf Pathan has come and gone. Well, it's the speed of the delivery, 78 k's. You've got a ball slower through the air on a slow pitch. 
the quicker you bowl the ball comes on better that was the mistake Jakati made little bit of flight might have been the carom ball getting the leading edge and a huge moment in this match Badrinath keeping his eyes on the ball takes a carbon Kamal catch and it's all getting very tense Yusuf Patan gone and it's 164 for 4 Kalis Kalis Fielder in the deep takes the catch Ravindra Chadeja hasn't had much to do he's fielded well in the deep Jacques Kalis it's gone for 69 is it turning the way of the Chennai Super Kings yeah well what a big wicket certainly is a city moment of success and what a time to get Jacques Kalis hang on Shiva hang on they're looking at the no ball Kalis hasn't gone yet they're looking for the no ball Shiva sorry to stop you in full stream we'll have to wait and see it might be a legitimate delivery they're just checking it'll be terrible if it's a no ball because remember they'll get uh, the the run and the free hit go foot go foot in out in out in something inside by a micron by a micron is that down yet i don't think that's down don't you want to keep that going well uh, i wonder whether it's the full toss situation i think they're looking at the they're looking at where the the ball came through whether it was above waist height but no no problem there at all no problem that's fine that sound will walk off that sound you heard was siva sighing in peace and so Carlos will go 16 needed from seven it's 175 for five great shot pass the infield go after it no the ball wins the race it's a boundary nine to get of the last over what a game 182 for five plays the shot it's in the gap for four what a blow what a blow from Manoj Tiwari give us a smile Shahrukh it's down to three from three now well there's that slow ball again put it away Dwayne get the Yorkers in the hole slow ball swing away too easy terrific shot under pressure now he senses victory Shahrukh ball of the match the well be it's pulled away this could be it this is it DLF IPL will move from Chennai and go up to Kolkata. That emotional story now has a wonderful, wonderful ending from their point of view. They've endured so much trauma, so much pain, and now they will celebrate as the Kolkata Knight Riders are the new champions of the DLF IPL. They did a wonderful job in the auction. They constructed their team very well. And now everything is coming out here at the Chinnaswamy Stadium at the Chidambaram Stadium sorry we're all getting excited a terrific performance they deserve it they've been a quality team throughout the competition and they have tipped up one of the best sides in DLF IPL history in the Chennai Super Kings what a terrific performance we got them what were you thinking at the halfway stage? Look, only one word comes in mind today that uh, mission accomplished because we started this mission before the start of this tournament. We always knew that we had the side to go all the way and people have been asking me a lot of these questions that our middle orders have not picked throughout the tournament. And I had a very strong belief that whenever the time will come and whenever we would need it the most, I think the guys would deliver it for us. And uh, I think thank you, Kolkata. They've been fantastic. They've supported us throughout the last five years. They deserve every bit of it, I think. Uh, They've stood by us in the first three years when the team wasn't doing well. So I think this one is for Kolkata. And one name I had to mention, Balaji. I think he's been an unsung hero. He, uh, we were playing for him. I think he's been an unsung hero and uh, missing uh, such an important game in front of his home crowd was always disappointing. But I think personally for me, it was very satisfying winning this for Balaji. Well, there it is, the DLF IPL trophy held aloft by the champions for this year. The Kolkata Knight Riders thoroughly deserved.